Hi folks, I'm Terry Tripler. Today is Tuesday, January 13th, and this is My View. Uh, yesterday, January 12th, Chris Elliott in his blog relayed the story of a woman who flew from Miami to Dallas, Fort Worth on American Airlines, and she was really thrilled with her flight attendant, and so thrilled, she wrote a letter to American. You know, we don't get many of those because we tend to complain. We don't tend to write to compliment, so, so kudos to her for writing to American. She copied in Chris, and it was interesting to see what all this flight attendant had done for the passengers. She definitely went above and beyond uh, the call of duty. Uh, so what did Chris do with this complimentary letter? Well, he took it as an opportunity to attack the entire flight attendant industry. And he wrote, and I think there's only one logical conclusion. Someone used a time machine to transport a pre-deregulation era 1970s flight attendant to 2009. He also wrote that in 2009, you're far likelier to find flight attendants who are unhappy and bitter. And then he writes, these crew members are no longer here to make our flight more enjoyable. Their motto is, we're here to save your butt, not kiss it. Well, first and foremost, yes, they are here to save our butts. You know, I was sitting in first class not too long ago on a flight, and a flight attendant about 100, 110 pounds came with a beverage cart, put the beverage cart, uh, she, she stood ahead of the cockpit, then the beverage cart, and waited while the pilot came out of the cockpit, went into the lavatory. When the pilot left the lavatory, went back into the cockpit, then she moved the beverage cart and went about her business. So here she was, 110 pounds and a beverage cart, and she was the first line of defense should anyone attempt to get to that cockpit, no matter what means they were going to use. She was the one there to try to stop him. So yes, she was there to save our butts. I think it's time that we praise some of these flight attendants for the work that they have done. Things have changed since September 11th, and we have to understand that, and we have to realize that. So in conclusion, the way I look at it is American Airlines has a flight attendant of which they can be very proud, and Chris Elliott has an article of which he can't. I'm Terry Tripler, and that's my view.